Hey out there, thanks for tuning in. I'm at the closet today. I'm in the closet, now I'm coming out of the closet. All right, so I'm building that closet for Diane. Nice walk-in closet. Put the floor down yesterday. This is the floor I used. You know where I got it? Costco. Let me show you what it looks like when it's down. And then I'm gonna go into what I wanna talk about. I have a drop cloth down because I'm gonna be uh, painting and putting the trim down today, so I don't want to get anything on the floor, but you get the picture. That is one beautiful floor. You know how much it cost? Did the whole, um, did the whole walk-in closet for about $150. Am I recommending this stuff? Yes. It's not waterproof, but it'll, it'll hold water or liquids for about, uh, 24 hours. So it still is semi-waterproof. So Diane comes home from work last night after the floor was done. She peeped her head in there and she said, man, that's beautiful. I love it. I love it too. Well, when she said, man, that's beautiful. I love it. Then I said, you know, it should have been done by now. Like getting a compliment, I want to deflect it sometimes. It reminds me of my mother when I was a kid. I'd say something, I don't know, maybe she made meatloaf. Hey, the meatloaf's really good, mom. And she'd say, hmm, it's a little too dry. Like accepting a compliment is sometimes more difficult than some kind of negativity. And I've been practicing this stuff. So this morning, I'm thinking to myself, because I'm thinking quite a bit, are you like that? I'm thinking, I should have another house. I'm in between houses. Oh, by the way, I'm closing on the refinance on the Water Street house tonight. He's coming over at five o'clock. Gonna make a little bit of money, tax-free money. Maybe I should make a video about that. Hold on, light bulb went off. Ta-da! That was special effects. So anyway, listen, <laughs> back to what I wanted to talk about. I'm thinking, I should have another house. I'm in between houses. Why am I not out there at like six o'clock in the morning, pounding the pavement, looking for houses, talking to the sellers, calling sellers, getting onto the MLS? Why am I not doing that kind of stuff? I'm still looking, don't get me wrong. It's not like I'm a slug and I'm just sitting down and not doing anything. I'm still looking, but I'm building a closet at the same time. I'm feeling a little down, like, I'm not trying hard enough. You ever feel that way? You ever have those thoughts in your mind, like those negative thoughts? You're not good enough, you're not worthy, all these other things? They don't come at me exactly like that. But I think you get the picture. And then another light bulb went off when I was in the closet. I was in the closet, setting up, and I had, ta-da, little moment. Because in the background, I got a YouTube uh, video on. Yeah, I think it's... I think it might be Robert Kiyosaki. I think I'm on that kick about assets and liabilities and stuff like that. Not my favorite speaker, the guy, but he's got a lot of good stuff to say. But I was thinking to myself, even when I'm in between stuff or I'm doing some down stuff, maybe some stuff with my hands, I got YouTube on in the background. It's either inspirational, motivational, educational, or spiritual. I got something going on in the background. Don't get me wrong. I got music on my, uh, on my phone too. I got disturbed and... Metallica, Black Sabbath, Eminem, you know, I got a bunch, maybe the Stones on there. But 99% of the time, if I'm not at the gym, I'm not listening to music. I'm listening to, to this other good stuff. So I want to give myself a little pat on the back. Not so hard that I break my arm, but even on a down, even, even when I'm thinking, I'm not doing anything to progress the business, the real estate investment business, the business, I am, behind the scenes. It's filling my head with different creative ideas. So, I want to make this video because I would imagine if you're watching this, you might be similar. And when you got a lot of time on your hands or a little bit of time on your hands, you start thinking different things, different insecurities, different uh, negative thoughts. And you know, it's sometimes hard to find a positive thing to think about. But when I was listening to the YouTube video, I was like, hey, at least I'm... And maybe that could help somebody out there that's maybe having a rough day. So when I get done with this closet, I'm going to make a video from inside the closet. 